welcome back to Linux Wednesdays where we look at Linux tips and tricks on a Wednesday. Last week's video we looked at six terminal commands which every Linux user should know. In this week's video I'm going to show you how to redirect an output as a stream. So if you type in a command and you want a hard copy of it like a, as a text file, I'm going to be showing you how to do that in Linux and this one is nice and simple. If we right click our desktop and we're going to go open in terminal, we'll make our desktop full screen and we're going to use control and then plus to make it bigger, and you can use Control minus to make it smaller, but let's make it bigger so we can easier to see. If you type in LS USB, which will list our USB devices, I want all this lot as a text file. So I type in LS USB space greater than, and we're going to type in LS USB dot TXT, and you can see there it's on our desktop. So when I press Enter, it's redirected that output as a text file. So if I minimise the terminal. You see there, there's it is our text file. You can do what you want to that. You can email it off and do what you need need to do to it. I can do the same thing with LSPCI. You see there, bigger text file this time. You may want to output it as a as a um, text file. So let's go LSPCI greater than LSPCI dot txt. You see that and it goes to, onto our desktop, and there is our LX. LSPCI, a bit easier to read of the stuff in my system. You can do the same thing with DF. So you can do a DF, greater than arrow, DF.txt. And on my desktop, I'll have a file now called DF.txt. Now it saves it to wherever you are in the terminal. So I do a CD, a backslash, and we do a DF.txt. And we'll do a lspci.txt and a um, lsusb.txt. If we go to the home folder, we should see here dftxt, lspci.txt, and lsusb.txt. And with all the commands for typing them in, you can read the manual page. So man lsusb. It says um, list USB devices, man. LS PCI, list all PCI devices, and man DF, which we learnt last week, report disk files uh, space usage. So that was how to redirect the straight output as a text file in Linux terminal. If you found the video of some use, give it a thumbs up. But if you don't like the video, the other button seems to work too. But as always, thank you very much for watching Linux Wednesdays. I'll see you in the next video.